You can link content items to calendar entries, which allow the students to click a link within the calendar to get access to that content. For the student, it can help them stay better organized and know when assignments are due. So to do this, I'm going to click on the calendar tab on the nav bar. I'm going to click to create a calendar event, but you can also edit a calendar event. In this case, I'm going to go click create and I'm going to click on add the content button. A new window will appear and it will show you a list of the modules in your course. If you would like to add an entire module to a calendar item, click the radio button next to the module and click add. You can use a different name for the title of the event by clicking the checkbox use custom name and entering a different title. That's if you want. You want to go ahead and enter a description so that students have a better idea of what needs to be accomplished. I'm going to go ahead and choose a date for this to occur and it'll occur all day and then I click the create button. When you do this if you go into the calendar item and click more for example you'll get to see that this is the module and here's the items that are in the module. If you're in the agenda view you can see that it will just show up in the agenda view and again a student can click on that item and immediately get to that without ever having to navigate the table of contents to find that item. We'll go back to the month view here and if you want to add an individual piece of content, what I'm going to do is click Create Event. Again, you click the Add Content button. What I want to do is click on the name of the module, and then it will show me the list of items within the module. Click the radio button next to the name of that module, or next to the name of that item that you want to add. Click Add. Again, give a description. You want to put a date at when this item is going to be due. I go ahead and click create. So again, what this does is it creates an item where the students can click on it and go directly to that content entry.